Hey guys, it's Caitlin. Welcome back to Quirk House. Um, our schedule has been so crazy. I know we missed a couple weeks of posting. It's been a while. Um, crazy things are going on. Um, personal life. And I'm also on a little uh, family trip with my, with my parents. Both of my parents were here. Um, but my dad and I have been here for most of the time together. Um, we're here on my grandma's farm. And so I just wanted to do a little vlog of our day today. Sassy is loving the farm dog life right now. And so we're just out for a walk. I'm actually gonna go look for my dad. Uh, I think he's gonna be shooting some guns today. <clears throat> um, this farm is actually where my dad grew up and so it's really fun to be here and it's really special for me to see him here. He has a really special connection to this property uh, and so I love just walking around with him out here. It's a gorgeous day. Um, yeah, so we're just having fun. Sassy had so much fun on the farm this week and especially yesterday. I'll have to add a picture for you guys. I'll add it here. Uh, Sassy was really having fun running around, off her leash, playing in the mud. Uh, there's also like five other dogs here, so she loves playing with them. And so that was the first picture I took. And the, the second picture happened 10 minutes later. Um, one of the barns here has a dirt floor inside the barn. And she got in there. And at that point, she was already dirty. I knew I was going to have to give her bath, so I didn't care. And she got significantly worse. And so I have a feeling she's going to get dirty again today, so she'll probably get another bath. But we'll see. So we're going to go find my dad. Sassy, come on. Here she comes. Sassy. Sassy. Explain what we got here. Okay, so we're in Kentucky. We have a lot of guns here. Some of these were family items. We got a 30-30 lever action with a scope, 30-30 lever action without a scope, a 35 caliber with a scope, a mini 14, which is a 223 caliber with a scope, a 12 gauge shotgun. A 22 target pistol and a Glock 42, which is a 380 caliber. And we're going to do some target shooting, playing. Interesting. Country times. All right, so this first gun he's going to shoot is actually <clears throat> going to go to Nicholas in a couple of months. So he's going to play with it for make sure it works okay. So. That was terrible. Sassy, what'd you think? Okay, Sass, come on this way.
I did it. I think you hit one. I thought it was my first time ever shooting a gun. I uh, didn't even know how to aim it. Those two were my dad's. I think that one was mine. So, I guess you could say I have a better aim. I mean, some people are just naturals. What can I say? Sassy, how are you, baby? Sassy's not a fan of the guns, but she sure is loving running around. Hi, cutie. Hi, Sassy. Let's look at you. Oh, you're so dirty. You're so dirty. Look at you. All right, I think Sassy decided she didn't want to play with us anymore, so she's already back at the house. Um, I think I mentioned earlier, you know, we live in not a city, but we don't live on a rural farm like this, and so she has to stay on the leash all the time. She's been loving the off-leash life. I told my dad back there, I was like, I'm getting less concerned about Sassy's whereabouts as each day goes by, because like, she's familiar with the land enough now, walking to and from the house, um, I think she's already back at the house waiting for me to come back, so that's nice that she knows where she's going and I don't have to worry about her as much. Um, so yeah, we're going to see how dirty she got. Might need to get another bath. Sassy! There she is! Hello, sweetheart! Hi, baby. Oh my goodness! How dirty are you? Hi, baby. Hi. Hello. Hello. Oh. Oh. Hi, baby. I think she's a little freaked out. Oh. Hi, puppy. Hi, puppy. Sassy. Sassy Lou. I think we're going to need another bath. Hi, Maddie. Oh, she's a little freaked out. Hi, cutie. Hi, cutie. Hi, Maddie. So many dogs here. This is Maddie. This is Lady. There's three more inside here. All right, let's go back in the house and see what's up. This is Momo. Hi, Momo. This is Sadie. Hi, baby. She's, she's a little timid. She's a little timid. This is Rusty. Oh, Sassy, watch out. Hi, Rusty. Hi, buddy. This is Sassy's buddy for the week. They've been running and playing. I think he's about a year old, so he's, he's still a playful puppy. And there's my dirty girl, Sassy. Oh my goodness. You need a bath. You want a bath? Sassy, you want to get a bath? All right. We're at least gonna wash off her feet. I don't think her body needs a whole bath like she did yesterday, but. Whew. She is nasty. Loving the farm life, but the farm life does not love her. So she unfortunately does not have the right hair to get dirty like this every day. She's just got to get, if she were to live here, she'd get a bath probably like every day. It'd just be normal routine every day. Tess, you want to get a bath every day? Do you want to do that? I don't think so. 
Someone's got her post bath aggression. Sassy. See? <laughs> 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 A ball? Go get a ball. Whenever her feet get wet, she just goes crazy. A ball? You ready, Sassy? Sassy? Ready? Sassy, hey! This way! Oh my gosh. Guys, it is so pretty here. Honestly, I I would love to inherit this property or <clears throat> buy this property in the future. Um, the only reason why I wouldn't is because just the area that it's in. Um, it's a pretty small town, um, and there's not a lot of job opportunities for Nicholas, and so it would be definitely a totally different kind of lifestyle he wouldn't he probably wouldn't have an office nine to five job he would be probably doing something with this land uh, for income something like that but I would jump on this in a heartbeat if I could um, I didn't grow up here like my dad did but I grew up coming here for like Christmas and the holidays and um, just especially this time by the end of the trip, I'll have been here for about a week and a half, and just having the freedom to run around outside with Sassy, sit outside, you can work outside with your hands and your tools, and you're not going to be bothering anybody, um, nobody's bothering you, <laughs> that's another important thing as well, um, just, I would, I would love to have this land, it's just so beautiful, um, hopefully someday we can have a dream like this, but... We'll see. But it's just, oh my gosh, so gorgeous. All right, so we're headed out for lunch now to get some local delicacy in a little small town, Kentucky like the only place within two, three miles of the house, so it's, it's pretty good. It's hopping today. Let's see what we got here. Is it good? So that's what? So like a corn dog. Hot. It's a corn dog. corn dog. All right. This is a cheese dog. Mm -hmm. I haven't had one of these since I was like eight or something. But now that mom's not here. But you know. have to explain what it is. Well, okay. It's cheese, and then it's fried. And breaded. And breaded. Like a corn dog. So just, just cheese. It's like that, but instead of the meat, cheese. <laughs> Onion rings, and then dad, dad got something. Burger. And a milkshake. Ooh, that looks oh. good. <clears throat> looks delicious. Mm, thank you. I wasn't gonna, but. Oh, you got it. Wasn't gonna, but you got it. My stomach's probably gonna hurt, but it's worth it. Mm. There's one for the big garbage can. There's not one for the smaller one, though. That's inside it. She's putting you to work. Yeah. We don't need to. Manual labor's cheap. Well, you're doing a good job. It's not, it's not cheap. Because uh -uh. I got a, I got a quickie dog. <laughs>